Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys and happy new year. 2017 is coming to an end and this year has been so much fun honestly since last year. Definitely one of the better years. I hope you guys also had a really good year and if you didn't you have a fresh start for 2018 so you can do whatever you want, your dreams, um, you know, you can make them happen in this new year. This is my favorite thing about starting a new year because if you did something bad the year before, you felt like it wasn't as great, like you have this whole new year to try to make something happen and try to make, you know, it the best year that you can possibly make. So this year I just want to like recap on a few things that happened because honestly like I had a few highlights of this year one of them being that I got to go to Mexico for the first time like I am Salvadorian and Mexican and I've never gone to either or until this year I got I went to Mexico like even though it was in Sonata um, I don't know if you guys have seen the cruise video but I did go on my first cruise and my first trip to Ensenada so I thought that was like the best experience um, just going on a cruise and like eating a whole bunch of food and taking pictures and like seeing things around me like seeing other like Hispanics that I've like since I've never gone to Mexico or like being in a country where you like you only speak Spanish like that was a huge one um but just like the highlights was just being in Mexico and in Sonata and going with my boyfriend and like spending a whole week like going on vacation that was actually like the first time that I've ever like been on a vacation like that for a whole week and like took time off of work because I'm always like working and I'm always like not wanting to take time off and everything was so amazing so that was definitely a highlight of this year also another highlight that was definitely like a huge highlight um, was when I bought my first car this year I bought a 2014 Mini Cooper and like I've always dreamed of buying like a Mini Cooper ever since I was 16 and I was like able to drive like I've always wanted a Mini Cooper and like even for my birthday I did turn 25 so that was like a huge highlight but I'll get to that later but even when I was like I'm like oh I'm gonna be 25 this year like I never thought I was gonna be able to buy a Mini Cooper this year um, but I said yeah for my 21st birthday like I'm gonna I mean 25th birthday 21st was like such a long time ago but for my 25th birthday like I'm gonna go and get a convertible Mini Cooper and like just drive everywhere and like the fact that when I was 25 or when I turned 25 like I already had my own Mini Cooper so I didn't have to rent a car like I still have to go rent a car so maybe I'll rent a different car but just the fact that I was like whoa like I'm 25 and I got my first car on my own without a cosign without anything with my own credit so that just honestly like felt so amazing because I never thought I was going to do this in this year or like have the courage or like have the funds to go out and buy my own car like it is expensive but that's why like that's what happens when you're an adult you have to like grow up and think about all that and start like budgeting money and blah 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 but I actually bought my first car so that was definitely like a huge highlight um other things that happened I did turn 25 this year so I was so excited actually not that excited because you're getting old but 25 is like a really big number I think um, you're like halfway to 50 and you're 25 like oh my god four years ago I was 21 and now I'm 25 but honestly like I felt so loved like, I went out to eat twice with my work um, my parents like made me dinner like my boyfriend actually bought me the cruise so that we can go together and that was my birthday gift but that was like an awesome birthday gift my friends like they went with me and we took pictures um, my boyfriend's sister like took pictures of me again and we threw like a party for my birthday and 
um, all my friends were like together and it was just like amazing experience I got so much love from all my friends in social media on Instagram and on Facebook so honestly like I just want to say thank you to everyone that like supported me this year and like you know did birthday shout outs for me and like watched my videos and another thing is that I went blonde for the first time like fully blonde like right now my roots are it's growing so I only have blonde in at the end but I like went blonde all the way on top of here so that was like a definitely a huge change too because I've never gone blonde but I actually like it so I might keep it like that or I might go back to being a brunette but who knows another thing that happened this year was that I reached seven years with my boyfriend and we've been together since high school and like we've had so many experiences together and like reaching seven years with him was definitely like another huge highlight because I never thought I was going to like find the one that I wanted to be with for like the rest of my life. I'm just waiting on like you know but <laughs> just kidding. I might edit that part. But I went to Big Sur this year and like that was also on my bucket list to go to Big Sur because it's so pretty. Um, we went to the Monterey Bay Aquarium and we went to LA or well, like Long Beach for the cruise and we got to see like a whole bunch of friends. I also got to see a whole bunch of friends from college. I graduated. It's going to be two years in June and I got to see some friends from college. So I thought that was like really fun. My best friend Matt who like also watches my videos and like talks to me and I got to see him. So I was excited about that because I haven't seen him since like last year. Another thing, I got my first URL on YouTube and I was so excited when I got that and I got that because I got I finally reached a hundred subscribers and that is like so special to my heart because I never thought I would get to a hundred like I didn't even think I was like gonna get any subscribers if that but I was like so excited that I reached a hundred subscribers and that was another huge highlight of 2017 because it is going to be two years in I believe June that I started YouTube wait oh my god so I was just like so excited that someone or people were subscribed to my channel so thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and now I have like 132 and like I'm like oh my god I'm like so close to like 200 and last year I was like I remember I was like yeah please like my video so I, I can get to 100 subscribers and I did like in August I think I reached them and I gave a giveaway so I was like so excited about that and it was just like a really really good year and I hope that this next year is like even better because honestly like it's going by so fast another like huge celebration that we did this year was celebrating my dad's 60th birthday and he reached 60 like I never thought I was gonna like see the day where my dad was like 60 and like almost retiring and stuff so like just the years just go by like so fast and like you can't stop it like you just have to keep living your life and keep doing what you love and like you know just keep trying to enjoy everything because like so many things can come to it and I try to make the best out of this year and I hope that you guys will in 2018 make the best out of that year the goal of 2018 I hope to push more videos out there oh and I even made like a Halloween video like that was I've never done like costume makeup but I actually made a Halloween video so I was pretty like excited about that but yeah for the new year I just hope to put more videos out there and um get like 200 subscribers now I'm pretty close but I hope to get like 200 subscribers or just you know make more videos honestly and that is basically my year for 2017 and I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, and 
think about what your 2018 is gonna look like and what you want it to be and like accomplish your goals don't make any new year's resolutions but make goals so that you can accomplish them in the future and you'll say like you'll look back at the end of 2018 and you'll be like yeah i accomplished my goal for that year so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and this is my new year's makeup look and i curled my hair so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and don't forget to subscribe to the little side button is it right here or right there i think it's like on this side but it's like a little red button and also down at the bottom but yeah don't forget to subscribe and then i will see you guys in my next video bye thanks for watching happy new year see you later